don't know how you say it. It's eye cream or eye cream. I don't know. Not beauty blender. This is not beauty blender. This is just a beauty sponge. I am who I'm meant to be. I am who I'm meant to be. Over and out, over and out again. My future needed clarity. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I did this makeup look. This is the first time that I'm gonna be doing or I did this pink makeup all over my face. I did some movie tones, but this is actually like literally pink and I never thought it would be really this pretty. But um, anyways, I'm gonna be using the Carity Rosé all day. They sent this to me or Carity sent this to me as PR package together with the blushes that I have here. This is the blush and this one is the pow pink one. And these are available at Carity.com. This one is $14 each. They have other palettes over there, but this one is $14. And this one is $19 at Carity.com. I'm gonna be putting the link down for you guys below. I don't have codes, I'm so sorry. But um, yeah, I just tried to share to you guys the look or the makeup look that I created with this palette, this gorgeous palette from Carity. Thank you Carity for sending these gifts to me and yeah, if you guys want to see how I got this look, please keep on watching. Now I'm going to be refreshing my face with this Sue Revitalizing Rose Mist. Okay, so now I'm going to be using this NYX Honey Dunia primer. Like I always do, I just, you know, like put primer right away before, you know, like putting my eyebrows and everything else, you know. So. And so for my eyebrows, I'm gonna be using this Anastasia Beverly Hills. This one is a deep brow pomade in medium brown. Okay, so what I do with my eyebrows right now, since I have like a droopy eyebrows I kind of like over line it or make a line over my natural brow to make it or give it a little lift so now I'm gonna try to clean up my eyebrows as it is not the perfect most perfect brows I'm still learning guys but um, I'm gonna be using this H rewind concealer this is in light Okay, so since we're gonna start with my eyes, I'm gonna open this box from Carity, and this one contains um, a brush. This one is, I believe, like a shader brush. Yeah, this one is a shader brush, and well, of course, it has this palette I showed you guys on my Instagram. It's Aram's Day today, but um, yeah, this one is a rose palette. I haven't opened that because I want to, you know, just open it with you guys on the video. And it, they also sent me this pre-shadow, long-lasting anti-crease primer. So I'm going to be using this for my eyeshadow primer. This is how it looks like. And it's still closed, it's still sealed. So I'm just going to break the box. I don't really like breaking packaging box because I like, sometimes I like, you know, like keeping it like I'm a hoarder. So this is how it looks like. Oh, it's a wand, okay. So let's just start putting it on my hand over here. I'm just gonna put a little bit like that. This is actually the first time that I'm gonna be using this primer. Okay, so let's open this. I am super excited to be using this. I don't know how it looks like in person. Cause I just only see it on online on their Instagram, but um, yeah, so this is it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! <sighs> Ooh. So, this is how it looks like. And for the first shot, I'm gonna be using this very, very light pink shadow over here. This is the bottled up. I really wanted to create a monochromatic eyeshadow since it's the in thing right now. 
and pink or the rosé color is the in thing. So for the next shadow, I'm gonna go with this shadow over here. This one is Hore. I'm gonna be putting it on my crease. And then I'm gonna go back with the bottled up shadow. I'm just gonna smooth this out. And then go back with that brush earlier. Now for the next shadow, I'm gonna go with the shadow over here. I don't know how you say it. It's I Chaim or El Kim. I don't know. Sorry guys. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go this shadow over here. And I'm gonna be putting it over here on my outer corner. I'm gonna change my brush because that brush doesn't really put anything on my eyes. But I'm gonna be putting this one over here again and sweep it over here from the outer corner of my eyes inward. How do you say that? But just going this way. So for the next shade, I'm gonna be using this court and I'm gonna be putting it on the outer corner of my eyes. And now I'm gonna go back with this shadow over here. This one is the Hore and I'm just gonna put them together or blend them together. Okay, I know it's messy, it's just because I don't shake my brush a lot. So I'm just gonna go to the inner corner of my eyes now and I'm gonna be putting this H Rewind Concealer again and I'm gonna do a cut crease. Okay, so for the shadow, I'm gonna be using this very, very light pink um, Frosé over here. Oh my gosh, this is really good. And this brush is really, really good too. It applies the makeup really good. I wonder how their brushes are, oh my goodness. Okay, that is really pretty. Okay, now I'm gonna go with um, cheer over here and I'm gonna be putting it on in the middle of my eyes. Let me just change the brush because I do not want to use that. But I'm gonna be putting this cheer over here, just right over here in the middle of my eyes. Just kind of like blend this two out. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna go with this Salute over here and I'm gonna try to put it onto my outer corner over here just to darken this out or smoke this out. Well, I'm gonna go mix the Salute and the cork. Okay, so for now, I'm gonna leave my eyes for a little bit and I'm just gonna go with my face. Okay, so for my face, I'm gonna be using this Maybelline Fit Me and this one is 240 beige. Okay, so now I'm gonna go with my beauty sponge and just clean this out. Okay, and I'm gonna be using this H Rewind again by Maybelline. And just blend it out again with my Beauty Blender. Not Beauty Blender, this is not Beauty Blender, this is just a Beauty Sponge. I haven't tried a Beauty Blender yet. They said it's really good, but I don't know. It's just too expensive for me for a Beauty Sponge, you know. But this one works really good too. Okay, so to set this all up, I'm going to be using this NYX HD Translucent um, Finishing Powder. So 
Okay, so for my under eye, because I'm gonna go back with my eyes, I'm gonna go with this Ben Nine Ben Nice Colorless Powder. Okay, so for my under eye, I'm gonna be using this bottled up again, and I'm just gonna pack it over here on my lower lash line. Now I'm going to be putting this Hooray too as well. So now I'm going to go line my eyes and I'm going to be using this Wonder One by Ciate. And I'm also gonna be putting this on my waterline and my lash line. So now I'm gonna go with this fun day and I'm gonna be pressing it over here on the lower lash line. And I'm gonna go back with this hooray to blend it out. And for my upper lash line, I'm going to be using this e.l.f. Um, I don't know, but yeah, eyeliner. And this one is in charcoal. So before I go with my lashes, I'm going to go brush this out. So for my lashes, I'm going to be using this Bad Gal Bang by Benefit. So for my bronzer, I'm going to be using this Undone Beauty bronzer or Warm Up bronzer. So for my blush, Carity sent me four um, palettes of blushes. They had Burgundy Blast, Boomberry, Coral Kaboom, and Pow Pink. But for this look, I just want to stay with pink. So I'm going to be using the Pow Pink. And like I said, this is all still sealed. So yeah, it's going to be the first time that I'm going to be opening them and using them. I just love using, you know, like new, brand new um, makeup on myself and see my impression and see how my thoughts would be like you know but definitely that carroty rose is amazing it's very pigmented it's not super it's not expensive at all you know it's not it's very affordable it's not gonna break your bank anyways i'm gonna be swatching everything that carroty sent to me this time and i'm gonna be putting the link down below on the description box so yeah Hope you guys will check it out. This is how it looks like and I'm gonna go stay with Hey There. Since my eye makeup is a little dark pink, so I'm just gonna go light with my cheeks. And by the way, this is a brush from Carity. I really love their brushes. And I'm sorry guys because my kids are up there. It's Sunday right now, so they're all home and you could hear them running and walking around and being loud. So for my highlight, I'm gonna go with this Sublime over here. I'm just gonna highlight my cheeks a little bit with that. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It's pretty and pink, girl. Before I highlight my nose, I'm gonna contour my nose first because I forgot to contour that. And I'm gonna go with the bronzer that I was using earlier. I'm gonna go with this shadow over here or this shade over here. I'm just gonna be careful with it because it's very, very pigmented. Okay, let's get back to the highlights. Like I said, I was using this sublime earlier, and I'm gonna be I'm gonna be putting it on my nose too. It's kind of like pinkish 
highlight and it's really pretty it goes along very or it goes very well with the makeup okay so now I'm gonna go back with my eyebrows I'm gonna be using this Ardell this is like a brow building fiber gel which is like a brow mascara So for my lipstick, I'm going to go with this Karatis Lip Lock. Okay, so for my lashes, I'm going to be using these Ardell Magnetic Lashes. And finally, I get to use this. And I'm just gonna be right back. So I got my lashes done and now I'm just gonna go set this makeup with this Sue Revitalizing Rose Mist. Okay, I'm gonna be right back with the final look. So this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. I just put my hair down and you know, just let it be but anyways um yeah i am totally digging this look this i never expected it to be really this pretty on me well i think it is pretty on me but anyways um that's what's important you know like how you feel about yourself how you think about yourself or what you think about yourself but anyways yeah if you guys haven't subscribed please subscribe and please give this video a thumbs up and yeah i'll see you guys soon on my next video bye